Hi, welcome back. We just thought we'd show you what it's like to live in a Class A uh, RV resort. Let's go. Let me turn the lights off. Um, here's our outdoor kitchen. It's yep. Very nice. Got a grill. Stove top. Lots of lemons. The fridge. Little dishwasher, more lemons. Here's a little island that I keep a bunch of stuff in. And over here we just got this, which is really nice. It's got a lot of room inside for all kinds of crap. And dining area. We're thinking about maybe making this a little dining living room area. We'll see. Last night. We had the glow golf, which was a lot of fun. People had little glow balls and the, uh, the uh, golf yeah, course steam. was all... I think it's quite nice. So Vicki, what is this drink here? This is a Austin Slammer. And what's in it? Slow gin, southern comfort, orange juice, and amaretto. And what are we giving it for? Glow golf. Oh, that'll be fun right here on the golf course. They can just come over here and pick up a little cocktail. Be very exciting. <laughs> I was born that way. Uh, <laughs> oh, that's good. Ooh, that's really good. What's in there? Oh my god, my eyes. Panties. Yes! Oh! Nice one! There's Steve, one of our neighbors. Hey, what's going on? <laughs> So they always have different kinds of activities going. As I said last night, we had the glow golf, and tonight and one what is of the glow golf? I explained it. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> they light up the golf course with glowing things, and then they have little balls that are uh, lit up too. And I can show you some video later of it. And so they golf through there, and people have drinks and snacks and stuff along the golf course for the golfers. And then today. Um, one of the coach companies, Beaver Coach, is putting on a uh, snacks and karaoke, karaoke, and brunch. karaoke and brunch. Yes, so they're going to have mimosas and stuff like that there, and um, little bites to eat, and um, show off some of their coaches. And uh, so yeah, it should be fun. They always try to have you know something going. It's not, you know, it's getting better since COVID is over now. But for a while there, you know, there was nothing happening. So it's been exciting having activities again. Well, and our park is pretty much packed right now. Oh, yeah. Um, since the Canadians came down, which was probably a good 30% of our uh, of our uh, people that live here, yeah. you know, in the wintertime. So. And I think they said that there's only maybe six or seven lots that aren't occupied so yeah. that's that's quite a bit and on the report the other day there were 11 lots only that are for sale right now yeah and normally there's a lot more than that we'll go around this way here okay see what see. so yeah it's been since covid you know a lot of people have adopted the idea of motor homing so um, a lot more people are looking for places to take their motor home and stay, or at least stay temporarily. So this has been very, very popular. All the parks have been and really booked up. And unfortunately, the rates have all risen everywhere also. So, but that's the supply and demand issue. I see lots of golf carts down here, so. Oh yeah, yeah, it looks 
fun. We shall see. Okay, this is one of the uh, coaches that they have on display here. It's an Allegro bus. Um, show you a quick tour. Wow, this is cool. They got a... Uh... Oh yeah, that's a refrigerator or freezer, I believe. These trays come out. Uh, there's two trays right there. Nice TV up on top. Um, it's a tandem axle, they call it, tag axle. Some more storage. Allegro bus. Let's take a quick walk inside and see what we see. Hey, how you doing? There's one of the inhabitants. Good, good. What do you think of that? What year is this? 21. You gonna upgrade? No. No. Uh, really? Yeah. Oh, it's very nice in here. Oh, I like the ottoman down there. That's a uh, hide a bed. Blue. Good. This is a 2021? Yes. 4 dollars Okay. You get a card? Yeah. Okay, have I seen this one? Huh? Have I seen this? Uh, this wasn't the one at the tailgater, was it? No, this is the similar refrigerator that we have. Here's a yeah. pantry. Pulls out. Computer table. This actually, this actually comes out further. Computer tray. Place for your uh, printer and stuff down there. <laughs> this one's got a, uh, there's a half bath in here. This is a great thing here. Look at this display. It's a large display, shows you what you've got as far as uh, fresh water, gray, black. Um, how much diesel? This has actually got a um, uh, aqua hot, which heats the floors and heats for the furnace. Um, your lighting. You can see right now we're being uh, uh, we're running off the generator. There's the uh, aqua hot slides. Yeah, it's great. We replaced our bed, our you also have these controls over here, so you can reach them. You can lock the doors actually from this uh, panel, or turn the fans on. Got a ceiling fan up there. Fireplace. <clears throat> TV. Lots of storage. And then the full bath back here. Very nice bathroom. 
Mine's got a, ours double has sink. Step in it. I, I was ready. I have it. You were ready. No, ours is in the leg row. I'll support it. There's no step in it. See, this is what Karen said, though. See, ours closet goes, it doesn't have this. So our full line closet goes all the way through. I had this room. That bottom drawer would be mine. Stackable washer dryer right there. After 12 years, then Becky finally let me put some clothes in the closet. And lots of storage, little safe. Oh, that's a fuse panel. Everything else is yeah, yeah, I agree. I do like how big they made the showers. And, and our shower in our new place. This, this, this is all on the outside of ours. You know, whenever you get your head on the wall, it's under the nose. But I love to sit there. Yeah. My knees are always dirty, and I need to scrub them. It's good if you have something like that. Right. Yeah. When you're parking for a long period of time, you want to Yeah. And the nice thing about the Lego bus, then this, this comes up back here. So you can watch TV with your head up rather than having to build up a bunch of pillows like we do, like animals. And this is 45 foot. You're going to sing? <laughs> you don't want me to sing. Yes, I do. No, you really How are you doing? Thank you. Oh, what's the raffle for? Oh, we're going to be doing some wines and stuff. Ooh. I'll take one. Yeah, you got it. Did you drink last night? Thank you. Yes. Everybody drinks something. Then over here. I mean, look at this. Isn't this beautiful? Okay. Well, it's a little crowded in there, but uh, let's go on to this next one. Now, this one is a competing company called Integra. <clears throat> a little different layout. They've got the trays. Got a nice uh, uh, refrigerator freezer right there. Also a tag axle. Also sold by uh, Beaver Sales. A little different layout here. Okay, this is a 2018 Integra Anthem. This is a 42 DEQ. This is one of our most popular floor plans. Very similar to the 44B, but it's a little bit shorter, more maneuverable, and instead of the bath and a half, you get a little bit more living space and a little bit more bedroom space. So a little more room around the bed. Uh, you have still have tons of storage in the back. Um, and this coach is gonna be going for 369.9. It's a 35,000 miles on this one. They bought it from us originally. Excellent coach. And come down and see us. We have a lot here at uh, Outdoor Resorts Indio. My name's Eric Shaver. I'm with Beaver Coach Sales and Service out of Bend, Oregon. And you can reach us at 541-322-2. 184. We'll hope to see you soon. So this is a different layout than the Tiffin had, but it's very similar, you know, as far as the controls and that. You've got all the main controls right here, which is so much better than a mass of switches that, uh, you know, the older coaches had. Um, a lot of storage. Here's the bathroom. Nice double sink. Let's see if those open. I don't know. I'm not going to try it. Nice king size bed. Storage above. Let's see what we have in back. And then here's a TV up here. Got to have a TV in the bedroom. Storage. Cabinet space. Cabinets. Ooh, some under uh, counter lighting, which is nice. Stackable washer dryer, you got to have that. <laughs> and then back here, nice big closet, cedar lined. And 
not a bad price. Here's a con hello. Hello. Here's a uh, little control panel for the lights back here. Yeah, it's very livable. Very livable. Look at the beautiful floors. Heated tile floors. Those are so nice. We have those. Let me tell you, wake up in the morning, there's no cold coldness on your feet. You just get out and you feel good. Our cat loves it too. Refrigerator with an ice maker. Oh, and it's got one of these little locks. I don't know if you ever heard about situations some people have had where a refrigerator might open and things fall out while you're going down the road and uh, that is a great feature right there. <laughs> Hello. Hey buddy. And here's one of our almost ex-neighbors working on, on your computer. A little computer, a uh, little tray, yeah, tray for your computer to come out on. Yeah, this is very yes. nice. Yeah. Very livable. Pretty. Oh, did you get a, a thing here? What? I hope so. It's going to be on our YouTube channel. And there's, there is somebody famous, famous Rick. Yeah, so this is a beautiful coach. It is nice. Anthem. Integra. Oh, Anthem and Te by yeah. Integra. Yeah. Let me see what it looks like. Man, that is a huge awning. Yeah. Yeah, so it's pretty nice. Uh, pretty nice resort. A lot of Prevos, a lot of Tiffins, a lot of uh, New Mars. A little bit of everything I'd, and some Winnebago's I'd have to say that the majority of coaches that are out here are Tiffin and uh, I'm not sure why that is but just the way it is I bet you if we did a report and how many Tiffins versus Prevost versus Winnebago's versus New Mars the New Mars and the Tiffins would be pretty close And uh, then there's, that's a, uh, I think that's a country coach, Holiday Rambler, not too many of those here. Open road, that's a Tiffin, Holiday Rambler, Tiffin, there's a Phaeton, Tiffin. Here's a uh, Newmar uh, Fleetwood, I think that is. A lot of people are building these uh, little casitas here, which are great. You've got a nice kitchen that's all enclosed. You can go there when the wind's blowing and still be, you know, in your outdoor area. Prevo. Yeah, it's a beautiful day today. Everybody waves. Everybody's sick of waving, probably. And our neighbors, now here's our lot. Our neighbors just sold their lot. Um, I'm sure for a very good price. We just added this rock. We had, uh, we were planting flowers in there, but you know, each year you got to replant them and uh, this year we decided let's just go with something easy let's put rock in there put one pot of flowers and we may change that from time to time on that one pot um, but it's a lot easier to take care of you just got to blow the leaves out from our lemon tree oh here's something nice I haven't seen this all season since we've been here since November there's finally a bloom uh, I was wondering if we'd ever get some blooms again. Usually, each year about this time, we've got a lot of blooms, and it just smells great on a lemon tree when you get those blooms. Oh, it's wonderful. But here's our little seating area. We watch TV right there. Um, got a couple heaters. This heater here 
heat set general area and uh, when we need some extra heat uh, we've got a, a great device back here let me show it to you this right here we just hook it up to a propane tank that thing puts out the heat like nobody's business and uh, so on the cool nights when temperature drops down you fire that thing up and man nice and warm there's our connections over there our skull you know we gotta name that skull you know what should we name it I don't know so anyway that's that okay well thanks for watching I hope you enjoyed this video um, this is just a short clip of what it's like to live here at Outdoor Resort Indio uh, we live here throughout the winter time and uh, there's a little events that are going on all the time is this is just one small event uh, mimosas and wonderful uh, bites to eat there so uh, anyway if you like this video be sure to click like and we hope you subscribe so you can see all of our other videos you'll get notified if you click subscribe and uh, again thanks for watching bye